Before I ne- get to my next guest, let me tell you why I have a guest coming on. Because on Thursday evening, February 8th, in downtown Los Angeles, outside the Crypto.com arena, the Los Angeles Lakers will be unveiling a statue of the late, great Kobe Bean Bryant. For those of you who are unaware, just to make sure I get the record straight, um, other sports icons with statues outside of the Crypto.com arena, um, former Lakers, Elgin Baylor, Shaquille O'Neal, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, Jerry West, and Irvin Magic Johnson. Former professional boxer Oscar De La Hoya also has a statue along with sportscaster Chick Hearn and Hockey Hall of Famers Wayne Gretzky and Luke Robitelli also commemorated with statues outside of the arena. And Kobe Bryant is next. Kobe Bryant, as you all remember, January 26, 2020, um, died in a helicopter accident um, with his 13-year-old daughter, Gigi, Gianna, and um, seven others. Our hearts still ache for what transpired, for losing all of those lives. But obviously, Kobe Bryant, to basketball lovers everywhere, the champions everywhere, stands out in our mind. That's why we saw that meme and still see that meme of Michael Jordan crying. It still hurts. Before I get to my next guest, 20 seasons Kobe Bryant played, all with the Los Angeles Lakers. Obviously a Hall of Famer. Fourth all-time in career points at the time of his retirement with 33,643 career points. Um, As of this moment, he's still fourth all-time. Actually, he was third all-time at the time before LeBron elevated. But it's now LeBron, Kareem, and Karl Malone as the only players who scored more points than Kobe Bryant in NBA history. Named to the NBA 75th anniversary team, the MVP of the league in the 27-2007-2008 season. Five NBA titles, five and two record in NBA final series, two-time NBA finals MVP, career postseason record, 43 career postseason series, 33 and 10 in those series, two scoring titles, two NBA scoring titles, 18 all-star selections, third all-time behind only LeBron and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, 15-time all-NBA, 11 times on the first team, 12-time all-defensive team, nine times on the first team, and a four-time all-star game MVP. In case you were wondering, why this statue is being erected to begin with. You now know why. One of the other things that we have to remember is that Kobe Bryant once scored 81 points in a game. He did this in 2006, in January 2006, going up against the Toronto Raptors. His 81-point game, in comparison to the current explosion of individual offenses in today's game, Kobe Bryant six times scored more than 60 points 18 years ago. Um, in that game, he was guarded by Jalen Rose amongst other players. Needless to say, it would be a perfect opportunity to speak to somebody that had to go against him that day. And who better to talk to than a man who would arrive as the coach of the year the very next season, who was coaching the Toronto Raptors in that particular game. The one and only Sam Mitchell, former head coach of the Toronto Raptors. (laughs) 